Hi, I'm Hannah Bernard. You're watching Market One Minute, and today I am here with Jed Richardson, President and CEO of Trigon Metals. Jed, thanks for being with us. Thanks, Hannah. So let's talk a little bit about Trigon Metals and what makes you special. As an investor, there's two ways to make money in mining. One is through exploration, where you're creating new value with the drill bit. And the second is that transition, the transition from spending to making money as a mine comes into production. Mm -hmm. We've got the excitement of exploration at Silver Hill mm -hmm. and then the near-term production from combat in Namibia. We're in great places to be operating. Morocco and Namibia are fantastic jurisdictions, very helpful governments, very good geology, mm -hmm. places where the world can count on the supply to continue to be continue to be there. Let's talk more about Morocco then and the project that you have there, Silver Hill. Yeah. Tell us why you wanted to add that to the portfolio. So Morocco is a place that's uh, been kind of close to my heart for a long time. I've been tra traveling to Morocco for the past six years, uh, built a strong relationship with a group of geologists down there, and they've been showing me projects. And this is the first one that we have, the Silver Hill project. It's uh, 16 kilometers squared. We have three structures on that property. Uh, the top one is five kilometers long, right at surface, showing grab samples of 200 grams per ton silver up to 1,000 grams per ton silver, 2% copper up to 12% copper. This is high grade, yeah. high grade material. Great. And, um, and it's abundant. And as we drill it, we're expecting to find more of what we've been able to find at surface. So this is, I think, something that's really going to get people's attention as we produce those results. And let's talk about where else you are operating in Namibia and the combat Mine. So what is it going to take to get the combat mine up and running again? Sure. So combat's an interesting story. It's a mine that closed really because of poor management. Mm. That's special because generally when you're talking about a mine being restarted, it's being restarted because it's a high cost operation mm -hmm. and it's shut down because the copper price went down. That wasn't the case here. The mine operated for 45 years, uh, produced 12 and a half million tons of ore at over 2.6% copper. Mm -hmm. If it had been managed correctly, the mine would still be operating. Mm -hmm. It's quite a, it would be a low cost producer. Yeah. In essence, to restart the mine, it takes money. Right now we have a study for recovering ore from an open pit, but we actually think we can do better than that. We're working on a blended study that would start recovering some of the ore from underground. The underground ore is 3% copper ore compared to the 1.1% in the open pit. Mm. With grade, you have lower cost, you have higher profitability, mm -hmm. and a better return for our investors. So we're, we're excited about uh, about what we're doing at, uh, at Combat. Mm -hmm. So let's dig a little bit deeper into the two places that you are operating sure. in Morocco and Namibia. What similarities have you found with them? As we're looking at copper supply around the world, Africa has to be where the copper comes from. Mm -hmm. Most of the supply projections are expecting that to come from places like Congo and Zambia. Mm -hmm. And I, I don't think that that's a play, those are places that the world should be relying on right now. Mm -hmm. But Namibia and Morocco, I think, really stand out. They have the geology, mm -hmm. uh, but they also have great infrastructure, very helpful governments, mm -hmm. and in those countries, we can, we can comfortably go to our investors and know that they're gonna get a good return yeah. on what we do there. And uh, we can go to the market and say, we, are, we can reliably produce copper. So it's obviously a very exciting time for Trigon Metals. Tell investors what they can expect coming from you this year. Sure, 2020 is gonna be a big year for Trigon. We've got, uh, we've got a drill program planned for Silver Hill, mm -hmm. and I'm expecting them to, to really catch, catch people's attention. Uh, and it's all going to be really shallow uh, stuff that could become that could eventually come out of an open pit. And then in Namibia, uh, we've been working on our on our engineering. Uh, we've been working with uh, Xinhai, a group in China, where we're hoping to get a export credit facility so we can use debt to start the mine. And then we're also going to be working on offtakes. That's another way that we're looking to generate the capital for the restart. This is pre-selling the concentrate from the mine. Because it's a short timeline, it could be six months for us to get this operating. There's a lot of interest from offtaking groups. And we'll have a bit of a beauty pageant over the next little while uh, and hopefully come to our shareholders with the best deal uh, to, to get this mine started without diluting them. Thanks so much for joining us today, Jed. Thanks, Hannah. Hi, I'm Jim Gordon. Thanks for watching this Market One Minute on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with other videos that we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click on this list to see other great videos from Market One. And thank you again for watching.